What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. This is Reader 5. Remember that's Reader for your entertainment. And welcome back to another indie video game review. Today we're going to be looking at The Office. Uh, this is a pre-release and it is subject to change apparently. Well, I found this game on Game Jolt. Uh, what it is, apparently it's a horror based game. I have no idea what I'm getting into. I just saw it and I wanted to give it a try. So what I'm going to do, remember guys, is that I do a playthrough and then after the end I will do a review of how you can kind of fix it. So let's go ahead and get straight into it, shall we? As long as the game doesn't... Oh shit. Party light. Just don't turn off on me. This is... Fucking scary. Oh, what is that? Oh, it's a goddamn door. What's this? Letter from management. Site A, J Corp's office building, powered by nuclear vision <laughs> generator. Beware the NFG requires shutdown, causes major power outage. Like six to eight hours power outage, please, from basement. Relocate to the safe room located in the basement. Shit. Did I already screw myself? Uh oh. This is. Uh oh. Hold on. I like getting bigger and oh shit what the hell oh now I hear something it's like my light does not work all the time what are you hi Mate, seriously. Okay, I already found the way out. I hear that. Oh, shit. Run away. Tactical retreat. Oh, fuck. Ah, 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 oh, Jesus Christ. Jump. I should know better than to go left. What is that? Oh, my gosh. Ah, fuck. I'm being followed. Well, luckily, they don't come up stairs. Uh huh. Apparently, you're stuck in the wall, you dumb shit. Hold on. What? Let's take a look at you. You're big hunky junky. <laughs> Not very scary. -y. I was expecting this game to be a lot more scarier. Oh, second. I'm gonna turn up the volume real quick here, so that way you guys can actually kind of hear a little bit better. Maybe you can. Hold on. <laughs> it's still a little too quiet. All the way back up, shall we? What it was is that the main menu is like bloody loud you can't hear jack diddly squat doodly hoo all right boy you you're looking mighty veiny i'm just gonna go here hi what are you i see what you look like you're like stone i'm 
already blocked in, apparently. All right. Ain't no going around them. Go, go, ka choo, ka choo. What was that? Oh, no, that's right. It's just the floor. Oh, no. Look. This is where I... That's where I came in at. Oh! What? Okay. So... <laughs> um... What can I say about the office? Um, so let's just talk a little bit while I'm looking here. Um, oh shit! Son, damn! Coming straight at me like a bullet train. Um, so you definitely got atmosphere, for one. Um, the only difference is I'm seeing some bugginess in my aim here. Yeah, I see it there on the recording too. It's like some lighting issues. And I can't commend you because you're using Unity, I believe. I look like a goddamn rat just running around here. This isn't new, right? No. Located. All right. So I'm supposed to be. Somewhere. But I honestly have no idea where I'm supposed to go. Hmm. Yeah, you definitely have the atmosphere down. You've got an idea started. But, oh shit. Um. Oh, stay away from me. Nee! Ah. And there's no real jump scare about it. Because, <laughs> sorry, I'm not talking very much during the gameplay and I'm freaking out a little bit. Um, let's see. I, I'm just determined to exactly get through it, but... Okay, that's down. Is this technically the office? Or the safe room? Jeez. Okay, this is really dark. There's some spook dang toodaloo's hanging out. Where are you? Where are you, blow boy? This is... Fuck! Oh my god! Holy shit! Fucking blindsided my ass! Holy hell! Wow! I'm gonna guess that there was a yet another motherfucker. <laughs> wow, you actually got me on that one. Whew. I don't know where I'm going, but I'm gonna say that this game is definitely in the works, as as per seen in the main menu, uh, and it, it's going going somewhere. Um, so what I'm gonna say, guys, is definitely give this a try and see how far you get, and then. Uh, definitely send some props to the creator, because holy shit. This is spoopy, kinda. I mean, to a degree it's spooky, but... To another degree it's not, shall we say. Um, that's just... Solely because... Are you fucking Blair Witching, mate? I don't want to get too close. See, he's straight player witching. I saw you down there. Or is that just light? Okay. That's just light. Wait, what's this? No! Is that. What was that? Oh, fuck! Okay. 
due to the silly fact that these guys don't make any sounds really when they walk. That makes them way more scarier, guys. So this is definitely <laughs> horror-based, uh, uh, somewhat. I mean, it's more maze-based. And... Arrgh! And that is just solely because... Howdy? Are you seriously gonna block the path? You ass. Oh, wait. I ran into something. Again. Nyam. Dive left. Dive left. Oh, snap. Oh, shit, son. Oh, oh, so that's how you're gonna play it. Ugh. Alright. One more shot, and I'm gonna give my best review, because I'm hitting a level where I have no freaking clue what I'm initially doing. Whoa, mate. That's not fair. You fucking player, what the motherfucker? Jesus Christ! God damn it. Mm. Can we just admire this light? This flashing party light of red? Who doesn't love a good party light? It's like. Mm, yeah. Red light. Party room. Escape room. Panic room. Yee yeah, yee. Yeah. Wait. Okay. Uh, I'm not going much faster, so. It's not like you give me any weapons or nothing. Nope. So this is strictly a maze game. So this has been The Office, guys. So my review is definitely play it. Give it a try. Send the creator plenty of <laughs> support. Um, just because, you know, I've tried actually picking up how to make games itself. And I have no freaking clue what I'm doing. So <laughs> I definitely appreciate you guys making these things. And <laughs> scaring the shit out of me, out of characters that, oh, good lord, my voice just went. <laughs> so, I appreciate you guys making more and more games like this, scare the pants out of me, make me think, make me smile, make me laugh, make me cry in a way. And it's video games make the world just like a slightly better place for everybody. Uh, it just takes you to a whole new world. I mean, this puts you in a, I'm going to insert an office because based off of that poster, it said that like you're in a, uh, in a facility. Let me shaking. Anyways, um, apparently we're in a, like a nuclear fission place. It doesn't make any sense to me. Like you're in an office. What, is, what the fuck? Is it just a light that's doing that? I guess it could be. But anyways, like, you've got, like, all these little things here. Like, all of your little, um, oh, gosh. What do, they, what do they call it in, uh, Unreal Engine? It was, like, uh, shit. I can't think of the name of the word. Wait, what's up here? What is this? Operating FG, make sure to follow the step plan. Has my gear. Whoa, okay. Whoa. Okay. What? Okay, so this is a part of the game that I just now stumbled upon. Whoa, you just threw in some new stuff on top of it. Oh, now I'm really freaking lost. OK, 
Okay, so this is down in the basement there. Okay, now I'm back to where I was. Arr, don't come at me, bro. So, all of your little bits and pieces here, like, you have to put this all together yourself. In Unity. So, oh my god, it does take a lot of effort to have to make these games. And that's the... That's the crazy part. <gasps> Whoa. Sandy man. Mate. Aw, oh, you blocking the way? Yeah, he's blocking the way. Of course he is. So, that's something. Uh, your game is a little... Broken? Shall we say? Oh, no! Okay, yeah, so your game's a little broken because your characters get caught up on a wall. So there's a bug for you right there. Um, you have to fix that. Man, give these guys some sort of sound. I can... I can barely hear them. Hey, your game is really quiet. Wow. Oh, jackety diggly shit. Woo -hoo -hoo. So, guys... Thank you guys so much for watching. This has been The Office. Remember, I'll leave a link in the description below for you to try the game for yourself. Um, remember, if you're an indie game developer and you would like for me to try the game, uh, your game, excuse me, uh, kind of like this and then do a review, kind of like go over like all the little bits and pieces of your game, uh, tell you how you can kind of improve. And I'm sorry, I've completely forgot. Um, how to improve upon this game. Yeah, definitely make it a little bit louder. Uh, get some more sounds in there, because... I can barely hear uh, anything. Uh, maybe a slider bar or something. Um, maybe a little bit more directive. Um, definitely fix your bugs. And I think you'd be right as rain with this game as long as you continue on with it and just keep on developing on it. So, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Stay weird, my friends. We'll see you in the next episode. See you then.